Robin, Frank, damn good to see you. Listen, love the show. Everything that's been going on so far, fantastic. I cannot get enough of it. The funny jokes, the good music stuff, it's, it's all fantastic. But it's crap, all right? The show is garbage. Look at these ratings. Can you explain this? <laughs> Utterly ridiculous. The brass is in an uproar. They got my balls in a vice. And that's not where I want my balls. It's gonna be a real issue, but that's okay. They called in the big guns. Big John Marvin, to be precise. But you know that, you work for me. You work for me for a uh, hundred years. I've been in this business a long time, guys. Mastered a lot of fell arts and evil machinations to make sure that I get results this time and every time. So get ready, take notes. Got a few things that are gonna have to change around here if we're gonna pull this show out of the toilet, all right? Step one, what does America want, hmm? You don't know. Of course not. America wants babies. They love them. Little children running around doing what they do, playing in toys and becoming each other's friends, doing all that kind of baby stuff. What do we get? Monorail babies, right? It'll be fantastic. Too easy. What does America love more than babies? Can you answer me that? No, you can't because you're idiots. But that's okay. You're beautiful idiots. That's why you're behind the camera and not on it. Too pretty for TV. Said it day one, saying it now. Guns. Blammo. Big old hand cannons. America loves them. The bigger, the better. We need guns and we need lots of them. Locked, cocked, ready to rock. All right? Guns plus babies, armed gorillas. Monorail commando babies. Bringing justice to Putin, one Ukrainian annexation at a time. I'm talking about kicking his rear end all the way back to the Kremlin. Whoa, I'm fired up just thinking about it. Can't get enough. Love the stuff. Are you getting it? Are you following me? Okay, okay, we're entering into a whole new realm now. I'm talking about fast cars, not a Porsche or a Lamborghini or an Italian hogwash. I mean American muscle, Corvettes, Stingrays, convertibles, hot blondes, hair blown in the wind with their wayfarers on. Like Don Henley said, Don Henley, is he available? Get him on the show, it's gonna be dynamite. We're gonna knock this into the new millennium. 3001, I'm seeing that Monorail has a 16% share. I think we can make it happen. We're gonna move from the 3 a.m. to the 2.48 a.m. slot. I'm in some talks, don't think I can't make it happen. Okay guys, we're gonna be somebody. I'm gonna be somebody and you're gonna work for me. Still, that's my plan at least, all right? Get a little bit of football action. Go for the angles that aren't covered. I'm talking about that European football. You know, European people playing American football and getting smoked. I say jump, you say please win. Next step, monorail. Title sucks. Gotta do something completely different. I'm thinking Tuscaloosa toilet seat. Money, my friend. The green stuff. Money I ain't got. Money you certainly ain't got. Money you're not going to get. No the, 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 the tongue recognition. You see what I'm saying? There's no, there's no, uh. You know what this show needs? Energy. But not just any energy. It needs killer buzz energy drink. Huge guitars, huge bass guitars, big strings. Do, 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 do. Going crazy. I play the bass. Do you want me on the show? Write that down. Write that down. Write that down. Because no one's watching the show. I haven't even seen it. I don't even know when it comes on. I don't even remember what it's called. I've already forgotten. Huge breasts. I don't know where you guys will be. Probably sipping martinis on the beach of Sierra Leone or wherever you decide to retire to. Is it war-torn? Yes. You think there's a spell in my grimoire I haven't already mastered? You're wrong. You're way wrong, Chief. I can cast every cantrip this side of the Congo, my friend. Cast them with hair, blood, feces, or any other fluid you care to touch or name. Hair's not fluid, you say. <laughs> That's elementary lesson number one. Look, the point is, I know black magic, and I'm using it every day on whoever I can, whenever I can. You need to integrate this into your television show. Why? Because it makes me more powerful. I'm a busy man, got a lot on my plate, a lot of spirits to commune with, and they all are out for blood, my friend. Literally. They are literally out for human blood. And I'm the only one holding them back. I'm not even doing a very good job. It's ghosts everywhere, and they hate you. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's that simple. You got that? Now go make that joke.
love it. Oh yeah? Well, wait till you see this.